man who played both Jim Morrison and Elvis Presley has never been your conventional film star. Almost as famous for the parts he has turned down as those he has taken, Val Kilmer's reputation of being difficult to work with has probably cost him even more. Born on New Year's Eve in 1959, Val knew heartache and tragedy early in his life. His parents divorced when he was just nine, and then his younger brother Wesley drowned in the family swimming pool while Val was still in his teens. His big break was as Iceman, opposite Tom Cruise's Maverick in Top Gun. His on-screen antagonism with Cruise famously spilled over into real life, with reports circulating about an ongoing feud between the pair. There was a story that Val even refused to take part in a charity beach volleyball game with the rest of the Top Gun cast because Cruise was dangerous. After this, the two even allegedly got into some serious fisticuffs until they were pulled apart. Well, I really shared an affinity with the character. There are other stories of Cruz mocking Val on the set of Batman Forever and Val taking his revenge by vandalizing Cruz's motorbike around the time of Eyes Wise Shut. The other rumors that continue to plague Val are those of difficult behavior. The most damning came from veteran director John Frankenheimer, director of the original screen version of The Manchurian Candidate in 1962. Frankenheimer directed Val in the notoriously difficult shoot of The Island of Dr. Moreau in 1996, with Marlon Brando in the lead role. Frankenheimer, who died in 2002, hated the experience so much, he was quoted as saying, at my age, there are two things I will never do, climb Mount Everest or work with Val Kilmer ever again. Adding, if I were making the Val Kilmer story, I wouldn't cast Val Kilmer.